Hello chemists and welcome to this Two Minute Tuesday. Today I'm talking all about atomic radius. Now don't forget to help us out by subscribing and liking this video. So we'll start by answering the question of how do we actually measure atomic radius? Simple, right? It's the difference between the center of the atom, the nucleus, and the highest energy electron. The problem comes when we have to determine exactly where that electron is. And uh, to do that, we'll use another atom as a reference point. And when they're bonded together, we can then measure the distance between the two bonded atoms and divide that by two to give us the radius. This can be referred to as the covalent radius or the bonded radius. So we're now gonna unpack why the atomic radius changes and what patterns or trends we can see on the periodic table. As the number of protons increases, the force of attraction between the nucleus and those outer electrons increases, and this pulls them closer to the nucleus and reduces the atomic radius. As we add more electrons, they need more energy levels, and these energy levels are further away from the nucleus, so they increase the size of the atom. We'll now relate this to the periodic table. So as we go down the group then, each new element has its highest electron in a new energy level. Now these energy levels increase the distance from the nucleus and in turn increase the atomic radius. As we go across the group, and here we'll look at period three elements as they are of particular interest to our AQA A-level specification, we can see that each element has an extra proton than the one before. Now this extra proton increases the force of attraction between the nucleus and those outer electrons, which pulls them closer, reducing their atomic radius. In general, as we go down the periodic table, we get an increase in size, and they also get bigger as we move from the right-hand side to the left-hand side. And this can be simplified into one arrow for our revision notes. Thanks, chemists, for watching this Two Minute Tuesday. Remember to share it with your friends, give it a like, and subscribe to the channel.